Now the station's up at the top of the hill. <sighs> I hope this works. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. God, we're in another loop de loo They always come at the most appropriate times, don't they? <sighs> yeah, they do. Thanks for the update. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, I am also... hope that. Ren! Nona, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren's... he's... he had an accident. He... he died. I couldn't... No, no, come on. Clarissa was dead too, but like bunny ears dead, not dead dead. Because apparently killing yourself doesn't actually do anything here. Alex! I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry, Nona. I didn't mean anything. What happened? He... he drowned. He took a fall. I don't know. He just... he just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. And... Shut up, okay? Just shut the hell up. I don't want to hear any more of your ghost garbage, alright? It isn't garbage, and we're not ghosts. Don't be rude. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. Um, a proposition? Like, uh, like what? It's already over for Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But, if you agree to let us take her, let her go, quietly and without fuss, we won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. We leave the rest of you cattle alone. We only really need the one, anyway. Um... Take her, then. You know, it's not often that we meet someone your age that's as... mature as you are, Alex. You really understand things. It's been surprising. I know what I'm doing. Don't... don't patronize me. We know that you know. As you were, Alex. We've enjoyed engaging with you tonight. He was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just gone. It's okay, Nona. You, you didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course, it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm sorry. It's. I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is. He was more important. It's not stupid. It's not small to like somebody. It doesn't... it doesn't diminish anything. <sighs> Maybe. Rin confessed that, uh, he asked your advice, and that you said to just be himself. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. And I don't know if he did. He knew, Nona. Don't worry. He knew. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. But thanks, Alex. The station's up at the top of the... Ugh. God, that was... My mouth feels like I just ate a tree.
You were possessed. And for the longest time, I think that we've, um, seen so far. Yeah, I know. I can kind of remember that part. Hello? Anyone there? What? Are they? Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the, uh, station speakers. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? They're both alive. Anybody? That's all I care about. Jonas? God. Yeah. Jonas? No, that's a bonus. Seriously, right in the throat. Jonas? 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 I keep forgetting this thing is We're all set that. here for the, uh, the thing? Okay, I just the have to tune machinery, speak and hug, or whatever we're doing? Yeah, let's do it! Time's wasted. Like, actually wasted. Like, I feel my body wasting away. No, it's, it's okay for, like, dealing with stuff. We had to deal with stuff. What stuff? The, uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Oh my god, you guys, that... No, it was the... It was psychotic to... Hello, we're here. We made it. Hello. Jeez, finally. Thank you. If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. It is so nice to hear you two finding the sunny side of all this. We are. Well, he is. We both are. Don't let her fool you. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Hey, we're awesome. Awesome enough, at least. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and out. This isn't like a big thing, but I just want to say, I just, I think it would have been a interesting us living together for whatever senior year. And I'm just glad I met you, that's all. I'm just glad we met. Oh, Jonas, you big sap. Okay, all right, that's all, nothing to see here. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. And we're gonna be fine, by the way. There's no, you don't have to put it like, it would have been whatever to live together. We are gonna live together and you're someday soon gonna eat all the peanut butter and when I go make a sandwich, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> all right. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I get up tonight. But you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? 
I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. Who's Ash? Oh, you mean Amanda? My really good friend Amanda who's moving away forever? That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda, who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, because whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently. It'll be the last time, but maybe not for the reasons you think. I don't really care about the reasons, just for my own sanity, don't do it anymore. Oh, and just so you know, I uh, took your advice about Clarissa. I'm not gonna see her anymore. I don't oh, know. sorry. It's okay, I think she's great, but maybe there wasn't enough something there. And she's depressed all the time. I really didn't want this to make it worse. <sighs> Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do, like, work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately. This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Well, if you leave, I'd certainly miss you. Yeah, no, I'd miss you too. It's just that everybody here knows me, you know? I know you think I have it on Easy Street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. Oh, get off it. I would love if people gave me the benefit of the doubt even once, but no. What do I hear? Alex got the weird genes. Well, you did get Mom's creepy ankles, so... Uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Uh, it was hard? I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Oh my, how profound. I can't believe Uncle Pete's a mere failed actor and not teaching philosophy at Berkeley. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Alex? Stop it. Just stop. Ugh. You got, you know, you went bad again? I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done, now. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just, I'm sorry. Just don't say anything to them, okay? This is, it's just like a trap. Hey, secret secrets are no fun unless you share with everyone. What is it? Reveal yourselves. We're dating. We're dating. Nona and I, we're gonna date. Rin! Dude, what did I just say? What? They asked, right? You asked? Mazel tov on the happy couple. <laughs> Thank you. No, stop. It's one date at the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm, romantic. Uh, cool. I'm guessing that this was Nona's idea. Hey, I gave him a choice. It was either this or volunteer at an animal shelter that only keeps frenzied possums. Anyways, I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant or whatever. Whatever. Truly the language of love. <laughs> Shut up. You know what I mean. Well, I'm taking full credit for this blossoming... something. As well you probably should. Um, uh, so if this thing doesn't bend right, this might be like... The last time any of us are us, so I don't know. I don't even know what to say. <sighs> it's been 
on. In a really, really, really strange way, I guess it has. Come on, let's take a picture. Really quick. Ren, no. Just really quick. Custer's last stand style. That Contessa who farted on her deathbed, just like who cares? Yeah, let's do it. We're on a beach. Kind of. Let's keep a shred of normal here. <sighs> okay, I guess. Let's do this. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So, make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. We'll be back. Oh, I know. Oof. Okay. I... Uh, all right. I am coming with you, you know. Yeah, yeah. Listen, Alex, I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's kind of getting worse, actually. No, no, come on, Jonas. We've, we've cleaned the whole house. Nobody wants to scrub the toilet, but it's got to be done. It's got to be done before we can fall on the couch and watch cartoons, okay? Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? You know, I'm not really in the mood Tim. for... Tim. You call him Tim. It's... it feels, like, wrong to see one of these when we're not in a... a time loop, right? <laughs> yeah, it kinda does. It's kinda spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would've slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but do you think it would even have worked? Like, if... if Yugoslavia or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads, I don't know if this place would've held up. No, I think it would've worked. There's enough tons of concrete here to keep them from... mutinying out, I think. Wait, it's... Oh, damn. It's another radio wave lock thing. Wait, before... Look, if something happens on the other side of this door, just... Don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat. Do whatever you have to. Don't talk like that, all right? Nothing's going to happen. There's no way this ends like that. We won't let it. I'm not asking. I'm telling. Okay, Mr. Dramatic. Will you just shut up and help me with the door? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, you know what? There, there's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with... Like, why would this specific... Yeah, it, it's probably a trick, Jonas. The ghosts know we're closing in on, on booting them out, and they're throwing up distractions to distract you. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. But, I mean, it's, it's ghosts. And I'm not about to throw away the possibility this is something else. I'll be fast, but it's just too strange. All right, I know what you're thinking, and Jonas, I'm sorry, but chances are remote that this is, like, your actual mom collect calling you from the grave or something. Yeah, but how remote? Really? It's like breaking or something. Can you... can you fix it? I mean, it's just... It's... it sounds like it's her. Like a recording, or it's just... It's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but... Jonas, th this... it doesn't feel right. Something's wrong. Wait, wait, wait. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. Do you think it's like it could be, right? I... Jonas, I'm sorry, but I, I really don't think that's her. Like, really her. Well, how would you know? And I mean, you don't know that for sure. Well, I'm not saying I know that for sure, but from the stuff we've seen tonight, it just... This has to be possible, right? God, she's, like, so close. You can just... Can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even... 
I have no clue what's going on, but if you could it's just... too dangerous, Jonas. I'm sorry, but this could be anything, anyone. Too dangerous? We, I mean, you've been using that radio to do everything all night, like a Swiss Army knife, like a spork, and suddenly this is too dangerous? Come on, I'm sorry, but please, can you try and understand what's happening here? Just please help me out. I just can't... I just can't really get this to change, or... Uh, Mom, can you... Uh. Come on, Jonas, let's, let's just get in the cave and remember why we're here, okay? <sighs> Can't you just help me out with this, please? No, now. Really, we, we have to finish this before it's too late, okay? <sighs> okay. Clarissa! Did you get lost, or...? Are you just extraordinarily forgetful? We had a contract burned into this girl's spinal column, Alex. You shouldn't be here for our... Transition. Leave for the boat before we get distressed. I... I changed my mind. Okay, there's no more arrangement. I want Clarissa back and unharmed right now. Wait, what contract? What is she talking about? Didn't she tell you, Jonas? She traded Clarissa for the rest of your futures. You did what? Don't be so harsh, boy. Her desperation almost saved your life, but not anymore. I wanted to... I, I, I tried to do what was best for everybody, not just Clarissa, who seemed already lost. Alex. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. We're not going back. We won't go back. Clarissa. Child, wait your turn. Is that it? Is she, is she done? Are they, like, coming back now or something? God, we gotta... I don't know. No, there's... I think there's still time left. We can still do something. Okay, what's the plan? What are we gonna do? Hit me with it. I'm getting my fifth wind. We can't let us be too late. Well, well, I don't know. Maggie said something on her... whatever about tuning into the source of it. Whatever this is, whatever we opened, has to be a part of that. Okay, but the gate went blank on us, like all of them have been doing. How do we... how do we tune into something like this? I mean, what are you thinking? You're the one who's been doing this all night. I have... no... Ah, uh, okay, alright, this is... this is something. Hopefully good. Hopefully. Isn't it connecting or whatever it does? I don't know. Alex, just whatever happens, just. <sighs> <sighs> Hello, somebody there? Guess not. Simple. Yeah, I've come to close the hole. I've come to... to do what Maggie Adler tried to do 50 years ago, all right? <laughs> okay, well, it didn't work then. Why would it work now? God, you're so spoiled. You don't even know the cost of things. <laughs> Closing the hole with your stupid toy will spare your... your friends from our gloom, sure. But it will seal you. Oh, getting started already, okay? You want to check out the void? Fuck. We can see how long you stay on the throttle. Shut up. 
Whatever you say doesn't matter anymore. On the contrary, it actually matters quite a deal. One last chance. Alexandra, wake up! This course of action will only save those morons, not yourself. Don't you understand? This isn't the road you want to be on. You can't talk me out of this, all right? You don't even comprehend where this is happening, do you? They sent warships after us. Like we were the... The fifth column. It's... It wasn't supposed to be like that. How can I fix it then? Just just tell me how to fix it. I'm here. I'm in the, the past, for God's sake. I can't change this somehow? No, you can't change... Before, you can't change anything. We can feel this binding. You have maybe just a few moments left. We feel terrible, we do, but but you have to know why. Oh, very good. You know a good barter when you see one. Stay good. Yeah, I'm... I, I just want to go home. Believe us when we say we understand completely. They let us fade away. It wasn't a... A mistake to scratch our names off the ledger and pretend it never happened. It was a collective repression. And this, this hole will finally be our healing. They built a monument for you. How could you say that everyone forgot? Oh, the monument, the memorial, the hunk of metal. It's a bomb for their injured pride that they let one of their own fall. It won't hurt, we don't think. The change. <laughs> but we... Goodbye, Alex. God gave us memory, the saying goes. But that is all he gave us. Remember Teresa as she was. So remember your friends as they were. Because they will never be that. Ever again. Just work through it. Tell Michael to break up with Clarissa. It's for the best. But Michael's dead. How could I even... Whoa, wait, what, what's happening? Hello, are you... Look, is someone there? Jonas, if you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. When the time comes, let Jonas talk to his mom. His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. What, what is... How, how is this possible? What's going on? <sighs> well, that could have gone better. <sighs> right. Time loop. Tell Michael he should go to school here. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. 